we're young and in this world Chasing dreams and girls Running from our problems And I know we're old enough Pum pum pum, fire tunes exploding like bum bum bum. All family, no one is random. Dumb. Waving hands to the man, dumb. throwing parties, gum 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 gum. Tryna stick it up to the ceiling. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm showing you guys how I blend my kinky type four hair with this kinky coarse wig. And yeah, I'm going to show you guys how I style it as well. So the hair I'm using is from Nappy Hair Extensions. So thank you Nappy Hair Extensions for sponsoring this video. And just to let you guys know that this company is 100% black owned. So, you know, go and support the business. I'll leave everything in the description bar below. So first of all, I'm going to start off by parting my hair into two sections. And I'm just gonna section off the part that I'm going to leave out. You don't have to leave hair out but i prefer to leave hair out because i feel like it just makes the whole thing look a lot more natural especially for this style that i'm doing so now that i've got my part i'm just gonna put it away and i'm gonna start the braiding process I'm just gonna section off a little piece of my hair and it's gonna be in three sections. So each side is gonna have three braids and I'm just gonna comb my hair out and I'm just gonna braid it up. You don't have to start off with blow dried hair but this is just the way my hair was at the time. Normally when I do this, I'll probably have wet hair and then blow dry the front pieces of my hair and that's about it. So this could be a really good protective hairstyle if you're into that type of thing. So when I'm braiding the top pieces of my hair, I try to make sure that my hair is really, really flat so that I don't really have any bumps when I'm trying to do my ponytail and stuff like that. So yeah, just make sure when you're doing the top, top pieces of your hair, just make sure that it's really, really flat. And I'm just going to repeat that um, on the other side as well. and. Yeah, this is the finished look. Just kidding. So when you get the hair, it comes in this really, really pretty sack that you can use to keep your hair in. And yeah, this is the texture of the hair. I feel like it matches my texture so, so much. So if you've got like type 4 hair or just like kinky hair in general, I feel like this will suit your hair a lot. And yeah, it's just got some combs in it and I'm just gonna pop this onto my head. I just wanna say you guys, like when I got this hair, it smelled really, really nice. It smelled like it had some sort of perfume inside it, which I've never experienced before because normally when I get hair extensions, they kind of smell really bad. But yeah, that's just a note that I noticed. So yeah i don't know if you care about that but it was really nice so i'm just putting some bobby pins in my hair just to secure it a little bit more because you know i just need that extra security and i'm just going to comb the hair out just to get any tangles out that may be inside it and i'm just going to start like parting my hair off well the wig um just so it can blend well with my hair and i'm going to be doing two ponytails like a half up half down hairstyle so my trick with this hairstyle is not to put pull out too much hair so the tracks don't show and yeah it's pretty self-explanatory when you guys see it, you guys will get what i'm actually trying to do so yeah just keep watching So 
so what i'm doing right now is parting off my hair in the middle and i'm gonna make sure i part off the wig as well in the middle as well so i can do my two pony cells and i'm just gonna brush my hair all the way back so that it blends with the wig really really nicely After I've done the ponytail, I grab pieces of my real hair and I wrap it around the little pony so it gives it like this kind of high ponytail kind of effect and plus it makes make sure that I don't straighten my natural hair while I'm straightening the kinky hair so yeah. Now that I've got my two little ponytails, I'm going to start off straightening the back section of my hair and I'm just going to be taking small little sections to straighten the hair just so that it just comes out as straight as I want it to be. I don't want it to be bone straight but I just want it to be straight, you get what I mean? But yeah, um, I'm just going to do the chase method on this hair and to make it look a lot more natural for me, um, I like to bump my ends a little bit just to give it like a nice little style and yeah, I'm just going to repeat that throughout all of my sections until I get to the two ponytails again. So when I get to the two ponytails, I like to take smaller sections so it just looks a lot more neater and yeah, I just want the ends with the straighteners all over again. this is my final look guys i hope you guys like the video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one bye guys